What's up YouTube and ho ho ho, Merry Christmas. My name is Domino. Welcome to episode 48 of our Pokemon Reborn Let's Play. In the last episode, we traveled through the Chrysolia Forest and then made it here to Spinneltown. That forest was very complicated to get through, but we managed to get through it. If you do want to check it out, click the icon up at the top of the screen per use. In today's episode, we're going to travel around Spindletown and see where we go from here. So if you're excited for another episode of Pokemon Reborn, make sure to hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. As I said, Merry Christmas. Today, this video goes up on Christmas Day. So, Merry Christmas. At this point, I sh Well, when this video goes up, I'll be at home uh, with my parents. So, that should be fun. Now, if I remember right, in the last episode, we talked to this lady, and she said that all of her, uh, so, Spindletown, things are, like, disappearing all over the place, if you remember, and she was like, yeah, my stuff is all disappearing, I need you to get all of this stuff back for me, and gave us, like, a list of things, all we have to do is touch them, and they'll teleport back, so, we've gotten her bed so far, stuff's moving. Why is there a pot back there? I don't even know what's going on here anymore. Same. So how can I get this TV? Never mind, that's how I get the TV. Let's head in the mark. Did the entire Pokemon just disappear now? Oh lordy. Well I reckon it had to show up somewhere not too far from here. What does that mean? I don't know, let's check in these buildings first. Sarah retired to a gym leader position after her son was born. She didn't know she could be a model anymore. Incidentally, her son is a little odd. All he does is explore the forest or lock himself in his room all day. Who? We're normally very lucky in Spindletown to have a strong gym leader like Sarah. She's beautiful and kind, looks out for everyone, but I don't think even she can do anything against this chaos. What type is she? I think... I think this building was the first time that we heard her name. Hello stranger, come to marvel my collection of bug Pokemon? No, what a shame. It's a, it's quite great, I assure you. The gym leader Sarah's son is personally, is even personally envious. Bennett and I are great friends, of course. I copy, er, study his notes on bug Pokemon all the time. Miss Sarah used to be a famous model, she's so cool. Wonder why she always seems so sad though. Not watching the TV. This is the kind of game that I bet if you watch the TV, like you can get a Pokemon out of it. Stuff's just moving. Oh god. Welcome to the Spinneltown Museum. Admittance is 500, is that alright? I'll come back, because I'm sure I need to be in there for something. But let's finish exploring everything around. Ooh. It's usually such a pleasant little town and a nice break from the chaos of the city. But then, usually trains aren't materializing mid-air here. Alright, the Pokemon Center's here, let's go. It's the disappearing things are entertaining and whimsical, but the earthquakes are just jarring. <clears throat> so I was just setting... I was just sitting there enjoying a nice warm cup of cherubi mint tea and suddenly literally all the furniture in my apartment just disappeared. Even the chair I was sitting on. I fell to the ground instantly and spilled tea all over myself. This whole town has gone mad. Ultimately these random happenstances through those strange or inconsequential. The wheels of fate turn in unseen ways. Always. This we knew. This is simply one more rotation. I've been trying to find a pattern in the strains at Appartition or disparation, as the case may be. As far as I can tell, though, nothing is being created or destroyed, only moved around. So this, whatever this chaos is, is just some sort of teleportation gimmick, or so I think. There's no way for me to tell or when or where it's going to strike next. Interesting. So first thing, we need to find the mart. We need to go into the museum. Have we explored everything? I'm not going in the gym. 
Why did that disappear randomly? Why did she... She just disappear. Where did this come from? Why is there a train here? I like trains. That's that's great. So if I walk all the way back. More stuff moving. More stuff moving. More stuff disappearing. What all do I need to get back for her again? This chair or something? It is. I'm glad I saw that there. Goodness gracious. Why is this box up here? What is happening in this city? Jeez. Alright, hold on. Let me go check with her. What all else is she missing? Bed is there, cabinet, TV, two bookshelves, two chairs, and the table. Okay. Am I to assume that everything is in this town? Table, chair, Eyes are scanning. Scanning everything. Well, there's a chair right down there. So I need this building to disappear. Also need to find another bookshelf. And to find a table. This place is a mess. All right, let's head on in here. Yes, that's fine. I have way too much money. <laughs> Most everything here has been recovered from the old room beneath Reborn. Would you like to hear of it? Although the city was destroyed within the past decade, this wasn't the first era of destruction the reason is known. Long ago, much, much longer, an ancient civilization called this ground their home. Little is known about them, but some of their structures still remain. Ancient inscriptions, tombs, tomes, and such artifacts. These are the things we've gathered here. Collectively, they speak of a certain object, heralded by the culture as a centerpiece of their religion. For all we know, whatever it is could still be buried beneath the rebuilt city. We'd never know. Fascinating, isn't it? The description on display describes ancient city beneath what is later constructed in the reborn city. Winding tunnels forged of stone glowing with power. A massive cathedral constructed around the crater. Why... All right, hold on. Let's read this. Inscription on display describes the temple raised to project an old site. Four keys of the stone's door, carved from blessed crystals cast. Inscription, blah, blah, blah. Thought to be the end of the world, but it was only the beginning. Records of Pokemon come from space. DNA of Clefairy and digitized DNA of Di Deoxys are laid side by side for comparison. The inscription on display, blah blah blah. Born of the heaven sent stone, ivory coat, and with a that word? arching collar. Blah blah blah. An enormous enigmatic stone burning with energy descended from the. This is the one, right? It's gotta be. It's the only one that talks about our. You! What are you doing here? Come to ruin our day again? Or can we ruin yours? In a place like this? The boss wouldn't be happy if we made that commotion. Fine. Domino, that's your name, right? Come meet us in Tanzan Mountain if you dare. The Ivory Beast, blah, blah, blah. Say something about the first creatures. They're... So they're attempting to get Arceus.
Okay. This laboratory is funded by the proceeds proceeds of the Spinel Museum. Viewers like you make our efforts possible, and as thanks, you're free to use our services. Services. What are you talking about? Scientists. I can turn fossils into living, breathing Pokemon. That. That it? I does not see the point of this place. Why did I pay 500? Ooh. EVM Z. I feel like I have to go back through the beginning of the game. Ooh. All right. Oh, that was her bookshelf. How am I so? How was I supposed to know that was her bookshelf? How am I supposed to know? Like, am I just supposed to click on every table in the city? There's nothing out of place here. Everything here is in place. I still need this building to disappear. I need to find another... Didn't that already disappear once before? One bookshelf, one table, one chair. I don't need to ask her what I'm missing. I wonder if the... Mart that disappeared... Okay, that's cool. But I need this building to disappear. Did I check the gym? <sighs> okay. Luna? Oh, you're not Luna. Excuse me, I was supposed to investigate the source of a loud noise. Oh! That would do it. Who's this guy? Mother, the Pokemon seems to have appeared on top of the house. Say what? Is that a Maria? So it has. That explains why we couldn't get the balcony door open. Hello, who might you be? My name is Sarah. I suppose I'm this town's gym leader now. As for the shop, I'm afraid we might be out of luck there. Why don't you come inside? You too, Bennett. I guess I'm going inside. So, you're Sarah's estate? Uh, let's see, uh, that, that was, okay, her voice is more chill. Right, Sarah Volklane was once a famous model, so she's all about beauty and reflections. Her gym mirrors this, literally. Sarah loves to play games with her mirrors, increasing evasion, lowering accuracy, and even performing critical attacks from hidden places. In the mirror field, evasion and accuracy changes affects the strength, whoa, changes affects the strength and frequency of critical hits. Careful not to take a surprise attack, but if it happens, use that moment to strike. Her Pokemon has to come out of hiding to attack, because evasion buffs will be lost. Besides that, consider using beam and light based attacks. Those moves can be reflected by the mirrors and will always hit. Good luck. Okay, beam and light based attacks. So none of these, none of those. None of those. I have Bubble Beam. So are we battling like now? I'm not ready to battle another. Okay. Okay, cool. Well, greetings. My name is Bennett. As you heard, I'm a. What, did the, what was that word he said? Lip Leopard something something? You know, a person who studies butterflies and moths. Something about how little insects can go from what they are to something so much more is just so exciting. Wait, alright, I gotta change his voice. For instance, did you know that Cascoon have perfect memories? Despite never moving or doing anything, they'll never forget a battle. And once they evolve, they're remarkably able to exact any, er, exact any form of retaliation for what happened earlier in their life. When you think about it, they truly are small geniuses. I think that's enough. You might be boring our guest. 
Yes, mother. Mother? Whoa! So, you were hoping to reach the Pokemart? That's unfortunate. I don't really know what to do about this. As I'm quite sure you've noticed, really strange things have been happening in this town the past few days. And I may be a gym leader, but bu buildings dropping on top of each other is not something I'd planned for. Honestly, all we can do might be to hope that it decides to reappear somewhere better. As it is, you're welcome to stay here until the situation changes. Incidentally, you're a challenger of into your challenger to the Reborn League, aren't you? As I think I mentioned, I happen to be an ice type gym leader. Luna is also a gym leader. Yes, she is, but we're not talking about her right now, and she's not here. Tell me though, have you at any point seen a young girl with very pretty blonde hair and a fancy black and white dress? And really pretty everything? That's enough, Bennett. I'm sure she'll come back if she wants to. I suppose I should explain for our guest. Luna is, or was, my adopted daughter. She randomly appeared one day. Apparently, things around here have a- oh god. Apparently, things around here have a purchase for that, and claim that I was her mother. And I am, by the way, quite sure that's not the case. I've only had one child, and he's right there. Nonetheless, I couldn't just turn her away. She is a good girl, but I can't just go on playing house with her forever. And now she's run off again, so that's good. Everything does seem to slip away from me eventually. Anyway, I don't know how to go about finding her real parent. It's not as if they're just going to randomly appear at our doorstep one day. Oh god. Well, someone is at the door! Bennett, would you get that, please? I can only do two voices at the same time. Please don't introduce major characters right now. That's a major character. Prosperitas Pax Passis Obwikium. Obwikium. Blessings of the Lord Arceus upon your house. My name is El, the servant of our Lord Arceus. Welcome, El. How may I help you? I don't suppose you're trying to get to the Pokemart, too. Incorrect. Rather, I have come looking for my daughter. You... you can't mean Luna. So, you do know her very good. Luna is the child who has lost the Lord's light. She walks the path of darkness, and as such, she turned the back on me as well. My daughter has denounced me as her father and run away. I've come to reclaim her. Well, that's wonderful, but I'm afraid Luna ran away from here too. And where might she have gone? Have you any idea? Why am I yawning so much, man? Oh, I'm sorry. Goodness gracious. She didn't say anything. She disappeared just as quickly as she came. I wish I could say the same for the Pokemon. Or half the guys I've been with. Whoa. Mother, please. Bennett, are you sure she didn't say anything to you before she left that might be a lead for this man? What? No, oh, that is... I don't know. I see. Miss Sarah Buckland, is that right? Oh gosh, my, that voice switched. I've traveled some distance to get here and I'm most stressed at having missed her company. I'd be much obliged if you would allow me to rest here for just a short while. That shouldn't be a problem. In fact, you may have arrived at a rather entertaining time. Is that so? I believe Domino here was looking to challenge me. L, Bennett will show you to the spectator seats. Domino, I'll prepare for your challenge, so please meet me in the in the arena behind me. I'm not ready for that. Found false swipe randomly. Alright, let's see if we can find the rest of these rest of the items in here. I really was not planning on doing a gym battle. Like, at all. Silk Scarf. Yeah, I clicked on everything. Based on that, I don't think any of this stuff is the stuff for that... For that woman's house. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with getting that stuff done. I, I'm sure that's for Mirror Arena. But we've already been explained what happened.
There's too many secrets in this game. I just want to click on absolutely everything. A bug memory. Weakness policy. Interesting. Aha! Aha! Can't fool me. Okay, now am I supposed to go do that Team Meteor stuff first? Time. And. Okay, there's still two things I'm looking for. I remember correctly. No! I know where the other chair is. I just can't get to it because the freaking So I'm I'm missing her table. What did her table look like? I didn't even notice the Pokemart up there. What if the Mart is in the what if the table is in the Mart? The chair is right there at the bottom right. But I can't get this building to go away. See what all disappears. Very curious if I'm supposed to. Wait a minute. Is that the train that we use? What is this doing here? Hold on. Let me take a peek. Bed's done. Cabinet's done. TV's done. Two bookshelves are done. We know where the two chairs are. I don't know where the table is. Wait a second. I'm thinking if I want to go back. But if I go back, am I going to have to redo this entire Chrysolia forest? Judging by that sound, I would say that's a yes. Oh, okay. That flower thing just keeps dis disappeared like six times. This building won't disappear though, and it's on my nerve. All right, hold on. Let's look at our team. So she's an ice type trainer, which means Scorpio Mine will be fine. Onobarus will be decent, but stuff will be neutral effective to him. Same for Mirror B. Everyone else will be fine. For Blast Burn, as long as I'm using water moves, I have. Rock Smash is a fighting type move that, I mean, could do something. None of these other moves are good against either. Could be another hard gym battle. I'm really not prepared to do another hard gym battle right now. Uh, I just want this building to... I don't know why. I'm sure it's not going to be hardly anything. I think I need to grind. Wait, 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 wait. I'm getting a table. I'm still going on about this. That thing keeps disappearing. Hold on. How was I supposed to know? So I need two things to disappear now. Now all I'm missing is... Why does that thing keep reappearing? That's what I'm trying to figure. Wait, what if I... Hold on. Have I tried clicking on the building?
That's what we call persistence. That's what we call persistence. Whew. That is what we call persistence, my Looks like everything's back. Well, sort of everything. This actually is in my cabinet, but whatever. I didn't have anything important in there anyway, and if anyone else has a problem with this, I'm sure we'll hear about it. Also, I found this in it. You should take it for your trouble. I am freaking down with that. So wait, I got someone I got the wrong bookshelf? Good job, Kadabra. Nice teamwork. You wanna trade that Kadabra? I'll trade you a meow stick. No, I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that. Okay. Well then we're definitely gonna wrap up this episode here. I'm going to decide if I need to grind, which I don't exactly have time for. Or if I'm just gonna run up and give it a try. I have no idea. Uh, but anyway, if you enjoyed our little exploration through Spittletown, make sure you hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. Our next episode is out on Wednesday and we will see you then. Have a blessed day.